Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix screen goes blank randomly on Windows 11. Before we start, hurry up and check out these over just under this video. Let's get started. So how do you exactly fix this issue? Well, there are a few things that you could try doing here. So first thing that you want to do is you want to make sure that you have the correct refresh rate set on your PC. So what you need to do is you want to go to your search bar here and just type in display. And you want to go and choose the option here for display settings. Now, under display settings, you want to go ahead and scroll down a bit here. And you want to choose the option here that says advanced display. Now, in here, you want to select the, uh, like for example, the monitor that you're having problem with. For example, this one or the first display. And you want to go and go to the very bottom and choose the display that is available to you. Now, some displays only have one option. So make sure to choose the correct one in here. Once you've chosen that, go ahead and see if that solves the issue. Now, another thing that you may want to do here is you may want to change your screen saver. Now, sometimes if you set your screen saver to blank, that's why you're having this issue. So you want to go to search here and just type in the following. It's going to be change screen saver. And you want to open up this setting here. Now, what you need to do is you want to make sure that this is not set to blank and make sure it's set to none. Go and click on apply and OK and see if that solves the issue. Now, if not, next thing you want to do is you want to go and open up power options. Just type in power options uh, you want to go and click on edit power plan here and what we need to do is you want to make sure that you don't put your phone or don't, you don't put your computer or your display off here now for this example you want to go and click on turn off display here maybe set this to never and you can always set the uh, computer uh, put your computer to sleep here after a number of hours or never here depends on what you need now, in this case, once you've done that, you could go and just click on save changes here and you should be good. Now, another thing that you may want to do is you want to go ahead and just do, uh, do a, uh, a scan on your PC. Now, you want to go to search here, just type in CMD and you want to go right click on command prompt here. Click on run as administrator. Now, answer yes, it requires further permission. And what we are typing here is going to be SFC space forward slash scan now. And just press enter now what it does is just makes a basic scan scan on your pc and fixes any issues that you may be encountering right now and hopefully this helps now another thing you may want to do here is you want to make sure that your gpu and windows is fully updated now updating your gpu depends on what you currently have like for example if you have nvidia you want to open up the nvidia app here or download the nvidia app and basically in the nvidia app you want to go to the dev site go to drivers and if you do see any updates in here, just click on download or install and just wait for your computer to uh, or your GPU to be updated. Now, it, it might require you to restart your PC. So before starting that, make sure to check your Windows if there are any updates. So go to search here, just type in update and choose the check for updates system settings here. Now from here, check, click on the check for updates, wait for, uh, wait for it to see if there are any updates. Go ahead and click on install if it requires any update. And once you have that, or once you have this installed, go ahead and start your PC and see if that helps. And that's about it. So, so if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.